This is our how-to video of a Singer Model 15 thread tensioner. Turn the thumb nut counterclockwise. Remove the dial. Remove the stop washer. Tension spring. The plus or minus indicator. The tension discs. And the guard plate. Remove the tension stud retainer screw. The thread take up adjustment screw. The tension stud is free to be removed. You can remove the thread take up spring. The release pin. The regulator. Okay, let's go back together. Now take the stud and inserting the release pin, the rounded point goes in first. It can only go in one way. Next we can put the takedown spring on the stud. You want to notice the finger sticking up on the inside of the spring. It slides in one of the slots on the cog. You want to put it to where the spring is about in the 3 or 4 o'clock position. Slide the tension stud in and put the two screws in. The little one at the back holds the stud in place, the other one is used to adjust the thread take up spring. I'll loosen the screw and turn the stud up a little bit. You want the slot in the stud to be horizontal. Put the thread take up spring screw in. I'm setting the adjustment screw at the top. You can readjust it later. Loosen the screw up a little bit and make sure the slot is horizontal. Tighten it back up. Next is the thread guard plate. It can only go on there one way. You'll feel it snap as it goes in place. The tension disc are next. The rounded area needs to face one another. The housing with plus or minus. The center line will be at the top. Now the tension spring. Followed by the stop washer. The little finger is pointing outward. Next is the dial. Notice the little stop cog on the inside. Place the cog on the right side of the finger on the stop washer. This assures that when you turn the thumb nut clockwise, it is increasing the tension. The little pin on the thumb nut goes in one of the holes on the dial. Then test to make sure the dial will turn from 0 to 9. The tension is increasing but I can tell that the tension is too great. I'll push the dial in, release the pin, and turn the thumb nut counterclockwise, about a half a turn, and let the pin snap back in a hole. Okay, that feels a lot better. That completes the servicing of the thread tensioner. If you've enjoyed this video, please subscribe. Click the button and hit the bell. Thank you for watching.